Hello, my name is Jonah Partridge and I make music for dogs. When you leave your house, your dog is left alone to emotionally fend for themselves with little to no stimulation. Does your dog have separation anxiety? If so, just click on one of my YouTube videos and boom, you have a virtual babysitter. I'm just so proud of this music and my wife has been nothing but supportive. This music is an inspiration. The, the channel has a multitude of different songs for all of your dog's needs. Uh, some of them are over eight hours long. Yep. Um, I, I work in the living room, so it gives me a more open space to create. Yeah. Oh, uh, and also, I like to include Theo in the process as much as possible. Don't you like to help me? Don't you want to play the piano? <laughs> Wait, okay, watch. It's incredible how he does this. It's better than food. It's better, it's, it's, the songs make your dog want to dance. They don't really dance, but they do jump up and down like no, this. No, they don't. Yeah, they do. Haven't you, you see Theo does it all the time. No. I play the music and my dog's like. <laughs> I also like to record my own sound effects. So like, <laughs> it adds more calming, peaceful layers to the music. So, I'm sorry, shh. That's soothing, right? I was crazy about him. We got married right out of high school. He had so much potential, such a talented musician. Last year, he got addicted to this goat cheese at the farmer's market. And I was thinking, this is, this is a guy who used to screw in public bathrooms. And this is our life now, with the cheese guy. <laughs> uh, I've been making the videos for about... A year. A year? Yeah, it's been a whole year. Um, Have they seen your scar yet? Hmm? He forgets he has a scar, but he has a scar. Well, I mean, Do you want to show them your scar? Barely noticeable. It's not true. It's just a scratch, really. Yeah, the, the bike got the worst of it. Let me show you. I had the car that day, and uh, he was on his way home when he got hit by the Uber. And that's my blood there. There was more blood, too, but it, you can't see it. It's like a pool of blood right there. But he doesn't talk about cheese anymore. <laughs> so that's the silver lining. <laughs> uh, too bad it's only two stories up, right? <sighs> uh, find something taller, <laughs> higher. Hate my life! Fuck! <laughs> All right, going back in. And then when I came to, I just, everything was different. I just knew that my, instantly that my life had changed for the better. It was like the clouds parted and <laughs> the sun's rays beamed down and my new path was revealed to me. You know that, that high-pitched sound that only dogs can hear? Well, I can hear it now. Uh, which is why the last four hours of my music sounds like I'm not playing anything, but I'm actually cued up into the upper most register. Can you hear that? I was always meant to get run over, I think, because it's really for the best. I wouldn't be helping so many dogs if, if I hadn't almost died. But I think probably, you know, they call it the Rainbow Bridge. I think when I go, it's gonna be a lot of dogs waiting for me to say thank you. You've subscribed to my page, right, babe? Uh, I will. I've just been a little bit busy lately. That's, that's fine. 
No, I'm, I'm thinking about branching out and doing an entire series just for cats. Do you like pumpkin? Oh, yoga class. Yeah. It's, it's Bikram. Bikram today, I think. <laughs> 